Hi, my name's Emma. I'm the School and Youth Programs Manager at the Bainbridge Island Museum of Art, and I'm here today for another Art in Action BIMA from Home. Today, we're partnering with Bainbridge Youth Services in support of their Hope Glows event to make Luminaria. <music> This beautiful event is to celebrate hope in our community and connect people through uh, creative expression. So we're really excited to be a part of it. And I'm gonna show you today a couple different ways to make Luminaria um, that will hold up in the weather and uh, look really beautiful. So let's get started. With Luminaria bags, what you wanna be thinking about is how the candle that's placed within the bag will light it from the inside. So with my first one, I'm just using scissors and the paper bag to fold and cut my paper bag as if it were a paper snowflake. So I'm cutting out shapes and as I cut, I can kind of see how much of the bag remains. I'm really just playing it by ear and I'm trying to make it so that the bag will cast interesting shadows and look really beautiful. For this second bag, I'll be thinking about how I can add color um, without really putting it at risk of dissolving in the rain. So I have some permanent markers here, some Sharpies and different colors. And then because if you've used Sharpies before, you know that they can bleed through paper really easily. Um, I'll be using a piece of cardboard cut to the size of my bag so that when the Sharpie bleeds through, it bleeds through onto the cardboard and not to the other side of the bag. So I'll start by drawing my design, and for this design I'm going to do a short quote and then add some decorative elements, just drawing some flowers and leaves and plants all over the design. And once I have all of my outlines in place, I'm going to keep that piece of cardboard in the bag and just go ahead and color it all in. So the idea behind this is that when it's lit from within, the all of the colors will show up really brightly and almost look like a stained glass. People of all ages are encouraged to decorate a bag for the Hope Glows event on Winslow Way on February 5th. Um, we will link more information about getting and returning your bags in the comments below, um, but we look forward to seeing what you make. We'll see you next time for Bima's Art in Action from home.